Hi there folks, Brendan from Advanced Radio here. Today we're going to show you how to set up your flaps using one channel out of your radio and the Smartbus RRS system. Today we're using the Smartbus RRS for Spectrum. As you can see we've got the four Spectrum satellites plugged into this one. Now we've got a channel assigned to flaps on our radio and when I flick that channel you'll notice that one of our servos moves and that's channel 6 from our radio. If we come over to our screen We've got input channel 6 routes to smart bus outputs 14, which is where I've got my servo plugged in. If I want to add more flap servos, all I have to do is select it on the bus. So let's add it to 15 as well. Now, when I get this servo here, plug it into 15, you'll notice that it instantly jumps, and now we have two flap servos. Assigning flaps is that simple with the smart bus. Now, as an added feature, with most planes, you have to reverse one of your flap servos. So we'll go into our monitor screen. We'll go into channel six, which we know is our flap servo channel. You can see that moving there. Go in there. And you can see 14 and 15 moving there on the screen. So if I want to reverse one of my flap servos, all I've got to do is go into the channel, press on the normal button until it says reverse. And then if we pan out, you'll see the direction of one servo has now swapped. Setting up flaps is that simple with the smart bus. Now as an added bonus you may notice that these two servos aren't perfectly aligned. To sub trim your flap servos you can do all that in your smart bus. All you have to do is on this particular page here which is accessed through the monitor page leaving your flaps where you need them to go to be matched hit the plus and you'll start to see that one moving. Hit the minus and it will go the other way. It's very, very slight, but in the grand scheme of things, if you're getting a roll on your flaps, that'll help drastically. We can do that for the center point, the, one of the endpoints, and even the other endpoint. Once we're happy with the uh, sub trim on those, all you do is you hit save, come back out to the main menu and your flaps are now done. And that's the awesome power of the smart bus.